Okay, hello guys. So here in this video, we're going to talk about the cocaine biosynthesis, right? So it is a little bit time consuming when we are drawing the structures. So I have drawn the structures before I'm coming to the video. So let's move step by step. I will explain what's happening and how it's happening, uh, how we gain the last final product, right? So here, this is our first initial product. We need to synthesize uh, our cocaine product in our biosynthesis methods, right? So first of all, I, I want you to understand this, right? This and this, this both structures are the same, right? So here I am showing you two carbons here, this carbon and this carbon. These two carbons are positions at here, right? As you can see, uh, I'm going to rotate this molecule. I'm going to rotate this molecule uh, across the plane, right? These two carbons are now in downwards. Yeah, this this is our this carbon so i have taken it upwards right i hope you are okay with this uh, trans transition because we need this structure like this when we are moving onwards right so just don't be confused just imagine these two carbons are now downwards so this is here yeah, this carbon is the, this one and this carbon here is attached to our chain is this one then the chain is same chain is the same this just the chain has uh, upside down so let's move on so this both are the same molecules then what we are want to do here is first we are going to oxidize our molecule Oxid so when we are doing the oxidation oxidation what happens over here you know there are two electrons over here here Two electrons over here on nitrogen molecules when the oxidation happens these two molecules will go on to this bonds to this bond to form a double bond so here we have a plus nitrogen and double bond over here so this over here right this is a alpha carbon which is little bit acidic due to these two uh, carbonyl compounds right so the next step the next step is this carbon this carbon will start to start a making bond from here so now what happens here is this carbon over here it will create a bond with up to this one so this bond will be broken back into the nitrogen so here i have drawn this bond over here this here this bond over here this is the newly formed bond over here and over here so and i have rotated this chain right i have rotated this chain across over here just to form this bond right? here this is the first carbonyl compound and this is the second carbonyl compound right so what happened over here is i'm going to take this carbon i'm going to take this carbon and make it a make it happens a bond with this one so here this is the bond here we have the carbon over here and here we have the carbon over here so at the second step let's move downwards right okay uh, at the second step as you can see uh, we are just doing the hydrolysis we are just adding the water so this last component will move into carboxylic acid i just forgot to tell you that uh, this reaction is the same as manich reaction which we have talked about in previous videos right just the orientation is different that's all so let's move into over here let's move into it so we are going to hydrolyze our compound so this component over here this component over here will turn into a carboxylic acid at the second step here you can see at the second step we are doing a O methylation using SAM. If you have not heard it about this SAM or if you are do not know it about SAM, uh, I will put a link up for the, over here. Just go around and see what the SAM is doing to our organic molecules. It's very important in biosynthesis and biochemistry. So I hope you okay with SAM. So let's move on. So what SAM is doing is we can use this SAM 
to add the methyl com methyl component either on a carbon nitrogen or oxygen so in this case we are going to choose a oxygen atom this oxygen atom to heat a methyl group and at the second next step as you can see we are going to change this carbon carbon to oh now just be where you cannot do hydrolysis on this case right because this is a carbonyl compounds you the, this won't happen uh, you what you have to do here is you need to add NADBH NADPH so what will this component do is he will act along with the reaction this act, act along with reaction when the reaction is completed he will come out as NADP plus this hydrogen he have released he have released that hydrogen so where is this hydrogen over here here yeah. this is the hydrogen which this NADPH has released so then uh, that's the uh, that's the thing we have done over here in this step right so and and the second step so at the second step what we are going to do here is esterification here I have introduced a carboxylic acid it's just a simple organic reaction here we have a OH group over here so these two compounds will react together here we have the introduced newly introduced compound and here uh, esterification happens so this is our final product this is called as cocaine so this is the uh, biosynthesis method of cocaine I hope you understand it uh, let's let's meet you in the next video